Hey everyone, I'm going to show you how to create an animated overlay in seconds. As you'll see in this example we did for AR segmentation, we used Veronique over her subject, her character intro. Um, that was done in After Effects using After Effects template. Um, this is going to be a demonstration on how to do it really quickly inside of Canva. So I'm going to head over to Canva. I'm going to hit File, Create New Design custom size and then I'm going to be using 1280 by 1280. You'll see inside of Snapic we're using 1280 by 1280 because I've selected square. If you select landscape or portrait please change the pixels accordingly. So I'm going to hit create new design and now we're going to make the background black and then just to note the timing up here this can be adjusted all the way up until 30 seconds. I'm going to keep it at five because inside our timeline, you'll see the freeze frame is happening. The duration will be five seconds. So I'm going to keep it like that. Let's head back to the design. We're going to go to text. We're going to choose this thank you text. Uh, this example is going to be based on a wedding. Um, so I'm going to say team bride and then you could say team groom and have two templates. Um, it's also super customizable. You can make it whatever you want. You just change, change this text um, according to the event. So I'm gonna change the text to start. So let's make this a light blue and then the bottom will be a dark blue. And now we need to animate it. So we're gonna head up here and hit animate and we'll go to burst for the team. And for the bottom here, we're gonna hit animate and go typewriter for that. So you've got burst happening on the top one and just make sure animate is selected so it's both animating in and out and the same for broad typewriter and animating both in and out so now you've got this animation we can hit play and you'll see it animates in and then animates out so i'm going to download this now as our first video and then what we need to do is just duplicate the layer and then make this now all white. This is going to act as our mask. Don't worry about the download. So this is going to act as the mask now. So we need to make it white. Head over to effects and make that white. So that basically what this is going to do is um, if you add this as a mask, anything black or with a bit of transparency will be masked out and anything in white will be will will show up. So we're going to make this all white now. So we'll make that white. And then also go to text and make it white. So this is going to act as our mask. Now we do want to download these two separately. So you'll see it animates in, animates out, and then it's showing the white animating in and out. That'll be the mask. Now we need two separate videos. So I'm going to go ahead and deselect everything and just select the second page and hit download. Then we can simply head over to Snapic again, jump into the template. You'll see this is the original video. It is showing up now. Um, inside of Safari, which is the browser I'm using, as Safari handles um, videos with alpha. Chrome and Firefox unfortunately won't play this video. They'll show like a, a black box here, but it's not broken. It's just um, unable to display in those browsers. Um, but for this example, we're gonna remove that overlay and I'm gonna go ahead and add in the one with color, which is that one. And then for the mask, we're going to have the white, so that's that one. And then just to confirm, so here we've got the black and the white as the mask, and then here we've got the color one, um, and that's going to act as the actual overlay, and this is what's going to be used to mask that out. And that's pretty much it. It's now done. We're going to save it, and that's it. So this will be the output. Animate in and then animate out. And then if you're doing a wedding, for example, and you wanted to have two templates, one that was team groom and one that was team bride, you could do it like that and have the guests choose. That's it. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next one.